Today I want to show you how you can use the multi-boundary feature on the Agros T50 or Agros T25 to spray a wide area on the, around the borders of your field. So to use that, you will need to use the multitasking. This feature is very good for bank weed spraying, insecticide spraying for row crops, and also for aquatic and vector control. So let's start uh, checking on the remote controller. So let's come closer. First, we go to begin. So you already, you can create a, an automatic field. You go here and make sure the multitask uh, is enabled. Then you select your field. You go to edit. You go to advanced settings, boundary only. Now you can see it has only one boundary. You go to basic, you select the distance from uh, basically the edge in here let's say I put 20 you can see it's at 20 so I'll change it to 10 in this video we will have three uh, rods so I save it save as as one save and then I select that field again edit this time I will go and select 40 feet and I will save it and save as two. Then I will go select that and press edit again. And then I will go to basically the settings again. This time I select 70. So I save it and save it as three. Save. Now, I can basically go here and select all three fields. So I will start by selecting, let's say the first one, then second one, and the third one. So now on this map, you can see we have three different boundary lines that we can go and spray. When we press use, you can either change the parameters for each uh, route, or you can select the same uh, parameters for all of them, right? You have the option to change them individually. And these purple lines, it means it just takes off here, goes to the first one, it sprays the boundary, second and third, and finishes it. So let's fly it over and see how it looks like. This was how you can use uh, the T50 or T25 to spray multiple boundaries in the same field. And I hope you have a good uh, experience with this feature. Thank you for watching.